Hi guys, this is Silvana here. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having fabulous time. Today I thought we would create a bold red look. So as you guys can tell, everything is primed and moisturized. Eyebrows are done. We're gonna get started on the eyes. And for the makeup look of next week, it's going to be this one right here. It's gonna be the Halloween look because it's gonna be posted on All Hallows Eve. So we'll do it together then. My first transition shade will be from the Ace Butte Falling For You. Falling For You and I'm taking the color Squash right here. Last Friday we had some of our friends over and what sucked about that Friday is that we, um, my husband and I were off, of course, and we woke up so early to finish cooking for, like, all of our friends. We made, well, technically I made, but he helped me. Uh, we made chicken gyros, we made chicken quesadilla, it was a whole bunch of chicken dishes. And the appetizer was, um... A soup, potato soup, and the salad was a Mediterranean salad. Dessert was an ice cream cake. Second shade will be pumpkin pie from the same palette. What sucked even more is that Mike and I stayed up Thursday night. Uh, we were playing Monopoly, and, well, I was enjoying kicking his ass a lot, so I did not want to end the game. And every time he would, like, get close to being bankrupt, I would... <laughs> I would help him out so he doesn't go bankrupt. And... It was a fun game. But... He did kick my ass on Wednesday night, so I wouldn't let him... You know, I wouldn't let him off the hook until I beat him. So... We stayed up until like, I think 2 o'clock, playing Monopoly that night, and then we had to wake up at around like 7 Friday to start cooking, so it was an exhausting day. Moving on, I'm taking the color Chestnut. What made it even worse for me was is that even after we finished the game of Monopoly, I still couldn't go to sleep. I guess my body was just like, no, you're not getting any sleep today. So I ended up staying up all night, tossing and turning in bed. So I already, like, I was on Friday morning, I was already waking up exhausted, like, wanting the day to be over. But I still managed to get through the day, even though I was on no caffeine. That was rough. But I did it, and I finished cooking everything I had to cook. Mike helped a lot. And we had our friends come over, and it was nice, still, even though I was, like, dying already. Going in with my It Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye Waterproof Concealer in the shade Medium Natural. I'm gonna cut the crease with it. First thing we did as soon as we woke up that day was breakfast, of course. Mike made breakfast that day. He made omelets. It was delicious. Taking the color Cherry Pie from the same palette, I'm gonna place that all over the concealer that I just put. After breakfast, I got started on cooking. The first thing I did that day was the loaded potato soup. That's the first thing I started. Um, I had already boiled the potatoes from like a day before and mashed them. And all I had to do was just put it, put it into the soup. So I just prepared the soup, did the broth and everything, and just threw in the mashed potatoes. And that was it. The soup was done. My advice, if you know you're having 
people over and you're cooking for a large group, do not leave everything to do in the same day. Whatever you can do to meal prep, do that. So, like, for my case, like I said, I, um, boiled the potatoes and mashed it from, like, the day before. So that I don't have to do everything the same day. And then I'm pressed for time and I'm nervous and, uh, you know. Going in with my NYX Glitter Primer, I'm gonna place that over my cherry pie color that I just placed on the lid. After I finished the soup, I moved into making my chicken quesadilla. And like I said, I had prepared the chicken from the day before. So all I had to do was just basically put in some like onions, some peppers or whatever, and start wrapping it in the tortilla shells and making it into a nice beautiful flour. And then throwing it in the oven for about 20 minutes and that was it. My second thing was done already. Going in with my Purr Festival palette and I am taking this shade right here just called Fireworks. While the quesadilla was baking I started working on my gyro, my chicken gyro. So basically all I did was cut an onion in half and, and putting a skewer stick in the middle. I started lining up the chicken on it and then after I lined up all the chicken I put the other half of the onion on top, threw in the glaze around the chicken and then threw it in the oven for about two hours. I had already had the chicken marinating from the night before so that's that made it easy for me. Going in with my Appeal Adhesive Liquid Liner in the color Jet Black and I'm gonna outline my eyes. While the chicken gyro was cooking I was working on the salad. We had a Mediterranean salad like I said. What I did was I already pre-cut all the uh, ingredients from the day before so all I had to do was just mix them together the day of and just do the sauce the tzatziki sauce or tzatziki sauce I don't know how to say it but that's okay so that's all I did while the uh, chicken was cooking for lashes I'm using the uh, Kamara Onique Mary Lash Handcrafted Fall Mink Lashes gonna go ahead and apply my mascara and my lashes really quickly off camera and I'll be right back lashes are on for full tutorial on how to apply them check out this video right up here to line my eyes I'm using the Molly gel waterproof eyeliner in the shade onyx after I finished everything for the salad that was it I think that was everything I needed to cook because I had already pre-made the dessert from like a couple of days before. On top of the eyes is done. I'm gonna go ahead and finish off my face really quickly. For a full face tutorial, check out this video right up here. When I come back, we'll finish my under eye and my lips and the look is done. Going back to the Ace Butte Falling For You palette, I'm taking this color right here. It's called Chestnut. So we finished cooking around like 3 or 4 and then after that I started getting re actually ready myself for the party. Then taking the color squash to blend in that color chestnut under my eyes. To get ready I started by changing my clothes, you know, unhooking my hair and doing my makeup. Taking the color cider to highlight my brow bone and my inner corner. Our friends started arriving around like 6 o'clock. And we started with drinks as usual. Mainly water, not, not drinks like drinks. Then 
With everything else being done, the only thing left to do is the lips. And for lips, I'm using the MAC lipstick in the shade Ruby Woo. After our friends, all of them came, we started sitting down to eat. They enjoyed the food so much, and to be honest, we enjoyed the company so much. And it was a very nice night. To set my face, I'm using the Farsali Rose Gold Skin Mist. This is the finished look, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, subscribe to my channel, like and share with your friends. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified every week when I post a video. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.